former Minister of Petroleum, Tam David West, has opined that President Mohamedou Buhari's mistakes in his first four months in power are haunting his government. David West, who is an ally of the president, said Buhari made a mistake in the appointment of those working with him. He claimed that the cabal working with the president are no longer working in his interest. Speaking with Guardian, the former minister said that the economy is not doing well because Buhari made a mistake in appointments. He stated that the president should have appointed Dudo Adoma, who is the minister of budget, as the minister of finance instead of Kamiad Aosan. David West also insisted that there was a lot of suffering under the current administration. He said, you are elected to change and you can do the change. He made a mistake in the first four months. The mistake is what is haunting his government. The people, who he surrounded himself with, now cabals are not working in his interest. I told him before his wife went to the press, that the people are working against him. I have said it before that the economy is not doing well. People are suffering. I told him to alleviate the suffering. Give greater happiness to the greatest number. Let me be personal. If I were Buhari, the person I would have appointed the Minister of Finance is Udo Adoma, who is the Minister of Budget. That is not a good place for him. The economy is not doing well because of the mistaken appointment. I am not saying the Minister of Finance is not doing well. I do not know her. From what I have seen on television, she talks well, but talk is not enough. People are suffering. I am a die-hard Buharist, but I cannot close my eyes and my conscience to admit there is not a lot of suffering. And something should be done about it. But, I want him to contest, because by our constitution, he has the right to contest and sentimental too. He suffered a lot to be elected. I have never joined any political party, but I support principles and persons. I do not see anybody in the political terrain that can contest against Buhari on moral turf. That is his greatest asset.